Mac here for Tools today. Let's go over these DeWalt Tough System 2.0 sort of half unit cases that get locked into the bigger cases. Now these things are actually inexpensive. These are $20 each. All right, let's go over the specs of these really quick and let's see on how well these actually store stuff and the ups and downs of this system. Those are good. Those are good clamp locks. As you get it, you can hear that just like bust open. All right, so these are IP65 rated. The, these units could hold up to 22 pounds. All right, and, they, and how these units lock into the big cases is they go back to back. They get locked in like that, then you clamp them down. And so then the bigger unit could go on here. All right, I think that these are actually two good units. These, they're a good price, they're a tough system, so it's actually not that bad. But one thing I am disappointed about is that in these containers, you do not have dividers that go inside. I wish that it came with them. Uh, I have two units and neither of them have it. So I'm gonna assume that it doesn't come with it and someone didn't steal them and put uh, just put these units back. The DeWalt Tough System 2.0 is a fantastic system to store your tools in. They're very portable, they're extremely very tough, just like the Milwaukee Packout is. But I do think DeWalt needs to branch out and make more of these units that are different designs. You know, they do need to do what Milwaukee Packout is doing. They need to make Tough System 2.0 that's actually tools and not just a radio or like a, a battery generator. Let's do a test, let's take that. It doesn't move that much, barely, it doesn't move. It barely moves that much, so this is a tough system, and I'm using all my might on that. It is a very tough system. Okay. This comes with six into uh, six individual storage units. You know, you can put uh, you can put bits in there, screws, whatever you need, uh, pipe fitters, and so this is actually a good. I I do love the Dewalt Tough System 2.0, but I do love the Milwaukee Packout more. But these units are actually pretty inexpensive. And yes, the DeWalt Tough Substance 2.0 is cheaper than uh, Milwaukee Packout. I do love the black and yellow. The black and yellow is a good combination with the volume of color. And yeah, those, those are locked in. Like, those are seriously locked in. But if you guys were interested on purchasing these, if you guys see these at your Home Depot, I do suggest you get them. Even if you're not into the Tough System 2.0 uh, hardcore where you have the bigger units, getting this unit individually is actually still pretty good because these are actually pretty deep. These are deep little containers that you have in there. And th this would store a lot of screws or fittings or whatever you need to put in here. You know, and they're inexpensive. You know, they're the same price as Hus. These are actually sort of the same price as Husky. And these are seriously a tough system. Now, just like I said, you could, it interlocks like that. And then in the front, push down, then it's one unit. And so I seriously, I do recommend if you guys find this, pick these up because these are sold out at my Home Depot. I got the, I, I picked these up as soon as they put them on the floor, then they were gone that day. Because I actually went back and I tried to get some more, but they were gone. So this is a good purchase. So if you guys see this at your Home Depot, I 100% you guys get this. And one more time, this is IP65 rated. These support up to 22 pounds. The dimensions of this is 36.7 by 26.6 by 13.2 centimeters. All right, or in inches, it is 14 and 3 eighths by 10 and 3 eighths by 5 and 1 eighth inches. And so, yeah, like I said, I'll put it in a display of much more detailed picture of the Tough System 2.0. If you guys were interested in getting into a tool storage system, I do recommend, uh, I do highly recommend also getting into the DeWalt Tough System 2.0. Milwaukee Packout or Tough System 2.0 is what I recommend. So that's pretty much it. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.